Cave art is one of the oldest forms of artistic expression that archaeologists have found across the world. Some of the most famous examples are found in Europe and date back over 30,000 years. The pigments were made from natural resources such as ochre, which produced a vivid red. These pigments would be mixed with fat and applied to the walls. The paintings are located in various locations within a cave. Some are close to the opening, while others are hidden in the far recesses of the cave. Given the difficulty to reach some of the locations, it is believed that the paintings were very significant to those who created them. Okay, so to make our cave paintings or cave art, we're going to need brown paper. You can either use a brown paper bag and cut off the end like this, the full, and then just cut right down the middle, and you have your brown paper. Or you can use any brown paper that you might have around the house, or really any paper you have whatever color. The key is to cut it to a manageable size. If you wanna do them at a table, you could also do them on the floor. And to give them a little texture, I would just rip the sides. Easy for kids to do, and it doesn't matter what it looks like. Just kind of rip all the sides and if that happens you just kind of start from another end and go up and one more and again you don't have to do this um whatever makes your life easier all that so now you have that and to give this paper a little more texture we're going to crumple it up like that and it's not as crumply as you want you can crumple it again Kids really like that step. And so again, find the plain side if you're using a grocery bag or anything like that. And then they can draw any sort of design that they want. Um, usually K paintings had animals or human features. So you might have them do like the hand like that, my lovely hand and kind of shading it out so it's one of those negatives that you saw in the video before this. So you kind of can just shade it in. Again, you do not need to be an art expert. Clearly, you can see I am not that myself. Or you could do a nice little animal here, here made a cat and four legs. And now we have Boots the Not the Helper Cat. So that's it, that's all you need to do. So hi, I'm Lindsay and this is my assistant Charlie and Nate, you wanna to wave to the camera? Hi. And today we're gonna to teach you how to do cave paintings. Now the first thing is you need some brown paper, it can be paper bags, and you hand it out to your assistants. Now, nope, here, before we color, we get to do something really fun. So cave walls, are they smooth? No, so we gotta crumple this paper up. Crumple it up. You wanna crumple it up, Nate? Yep, and then undo it. And then crumple it again. Okay, what is nice? and crumple, you lay it out like that. Do you want this one, Nate? Okay, and now you can start drawing. What kind of things should we draw? And you can color your hands. Here, draw some animals or color your hands like this. Remember, we saw the hands in the video. Ooh. Yeah. 
I'm looking for the cat for my mark. Oh, it probably fell on the floor. It's fine. I got it. I'll get it. Don't worry. We'll find it after. What other things are you going to draw? I, 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 I want to draw it out. Well, then you can give it to me, and I'll take care of it. Okay, what else should we draw? It's under his paper. Show it to us. Turn it around. Ooh, good cave art. Awesome cave art. Nate, what does your cave art look like? Can you hold that up? Oh, he's still working on the masterpiece. Yeah, you drew your hand on it. Yeah. Where's his hand? Oh, I, no. <laughs> 